Okay? So everybody should have a clear screen of list one, list L1, L2, L3. There are many similarities and differences uh, between United States and Korea. Mm, similarities are many mathematical tools and software and materials and so on. And uh, mm, differences are uh, thought, math, uh, teaching mind, teaching thought about mathematics education. One of the things I like my students to do is try and create on their own how to the uh, method to determine who is the best guesser in, in the class. Um, I was able to uh, give them maybe seven workshops and pull in some local teachers that would talk about PBL, which is project-based learning. And so they created a um, a project-based unit or student-centered units um, that embeds and takes incorporates uh, those workshops that they've been in so they're not just separated um, workshops or sessions but they're taking things that they've learned in these workshops and trying to put them into their unit uh, to to make it more student-centered to instill those creativity and critical thinking and communication um, skills as the students get older, their score is that's, uh, is not so good because they are uh, less interested in mathematics. So, and she thought if she learn how, how to teach mathematics creatively in the classroom, it will be better for them to have interest in the mathematics. So that's why she wants to learn how to teach mathematics in U.S. Arrow up to the very, very top, above the line, and hit clear. The key has been that at Indiana University, uh, we're able to uh, pull on a great number of resources. We have access to a great faculty, not only in math, ed, but in other areas that are supporting this work. And we also have access to great local teachers. So I think uh, we are really well placed here uh, with all the great resources at our disposal. In Korea, math teachers teach their students. They more focus on the uh, computation skills or calculation. But in U.S., the teachers try to teach mathematical concepts by thinking or by mathematical reasonings. They are also very interested in uh, supporting creativity in their students, and they are also very interested in supporting uh, uh, talented students. And so we've been trying to put together a program that addresses these interests that, on one hand, it shares what we think are uh, the best methods to teach mathematics for understanding. Uh, we do that using a project-based learning approach. And we're also trying to address this need of uh, creativity uh, with our focus on supporting uh, uh, mathematical thinking in different content areas. I feel that they have themselves this creativity and this um, risk-taking that they want to be able to do in their classrooms. Um, so I think by them coming uh, to IU and learning about the different kinds of ways that we go about um, making sure that students are engaged, that they would take that back into their classrooms and maybe try um, some of those practices themselves in their classrooms and see how it unfolds. Um, skills.